we were supposed to dip it in and out. Let me see. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, give me that, give me that. Oh yeah. Oh my stupid asshole. Apparently we're like nine feet tall because we can reach the ceiling without a ladder, which makes no fucking sense. <sighs> See, it, it's just I don't understand how this works in the fucking giant leg is just sitting there having a fucking bath in the fucking jacuzzi. Okay, so am I supposed to be watching this bukake about to happen? I can see you guys fucking grabbing your dicks. You don't have to fucking hide. If you keep telling me that, then you can go rot an L and go dance with the devil. Go tango with him and wear a fucking drag queen costume for me, please. Welcome back, everybody, to part five of Mental Memorial for Amnesia. This is Eileen Warnos joining... I mean, yeah. <laughs> joining you guys with this shit. Um, okay, we're definitely in a very ugly spot. I had totally forgot. I thought we were inside the hospital, like... Shit. But now I remember that there was a monster um, lurking around here, so we have to be really careful. I don't want any shit going down. Oh my god, that fucking ambience. Oh god. And yeah, I realized that. God damn it! Oh my god. Oh my god, so she's the one setting out these fuckers to get me. Holy shit. No, I'm getting really sick and tired of that damn screaming. Stop it. <gasps> what the hell is that? Oh my god! Holy goddamn! Ah. Ow! Alright, I think I'm safe here. Shit. That bitch! That bitch is the one that's fucking causing all this shit. I'm gonna kill her. Oh my god. Oh my god! Shit. I'm such a pussy. But I'm safe, so. I guess I'm safe until I get out there. Then I'm fucked. Holy shit, I see a gate. Hello. Yeah, you better be out. Run, but you can't hide. What? Oh my god, oh my god. Close the fucker. Shit! <gasps> that was creepy. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. I think this could possibly be close to the end. <gasps> oh, what the fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck? Why am I all blurred? I can hear something creeping in the fucking waters. Oh my god, maybe it's that giant dick that we saw. Holy motherfucker! <sighs> I was kind of expecting that to happen actually, so I, I... Whenever I saw that bitch coming, I just... In my head, I was like, yeah, I need to just be prepared. And that's exactly what happened. So, props to me, because I'm so brilliant. Okay, so... Brian, do you really want to leave this place? This has been your life for such a long time now. Was it me? This hospital? 
doctor. Obviously, it was you We've because you fucking sent you all those fucking years. monsters after I me. I recommended another recipe for your pain and physical vacation. I was wrong to do that. You were wrong to exist. I wanted you here. All these years, I haven't felt so safe and beloved. You gave me all that. Yeah, and you pay me you back by sending out fucking monsters and trying to kill me. To escape. That's some wow. That's what some real true appreciation. If only you were free. All this would never have happened. I've seen you release the highly toxic gas on the first floor, Brian. Yeah, well, you I'm not your fucking prisoner. Misery. Yeah, I. Oh, I I'm the one who caused it. Are you serious? And it's you, Brian. Oh yeah, me totally. You because you were afraid to pay the consequences. No, because I don't want to be with a psycho fucking I'm bitch like you, yourself. Brian. I'm on the third floor. I need your help. What will you do? Um, let you die, hopefully. Myself, but, but all the flames. Please, please save me. I, I love you, Brian. You expect me to save you after you fucking sent like a horde of fucking monsters to fucking kill me? Are you serious? You expect me to really save your ass? Get out of here with that bullshit. You can burn in hell, like I said. You know, I remember I said you can go in hell and fucking dance with the devil, and I'm gonna fucking fulfill that fucking promise. And somehow I got to the third floor without a floor two, a floor one, or a floor zero button. How that happened, I'll never know. But apparently I have no choice but to save this bitch. Which I'm not really thrilled to do because I don't think she deserves me to save her. Oh, okay. The fucking the other floor buttons just disappeared. I have no choice. I have to save this stupid whore. Well guys, um apparently this is it could be the finale. Because I don't see this going anywhere else. So what the hell do we have here? Oh, computers. What Windows is that? Oh, it's Windows 7. Yay! It's probably the fucking best um, version of Windows that was ever made. And then they made that fucking Windows 8 shit. That nobody fucking likes, but obviously we're obligated to use it. Well, if I have all this stuff, I might as well just heal. It's funny how I never really use these things, but, you know, I might as well since we're close to the end. Ooh, frisbees. I mean, frisbees. Whee! Bye. All right, that's enough. You found the roof key. Are we gonna I fucking? Explore this restaurant before I continue. We already have the roof key, though. I can already picture the ending. We're gonna fucking commit suicide. You found a fire extinguisher. I still can't leave. What about that? <sighs> Maybe. Oh, I think I know why, because I have to take a shit first. That's beautiful. So I need a flare in order to leave the shutter. Can I leave now? Because apparently... Can't you save me? Brian, can't you forgive me? Hold up. Save me and we can be together. Always. Don't leave me here. Oh, she's Brian. in there. She's inside there. She's inside there. Well, I'm out of here. I'm gonna see if I can fucking leave without her. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Oh my god. Karma is gonna get you so bad. Oh, damn it. Well, I have an extinguisher, so... No, you fucking dumbass. That's gonna make things worse. Alright. See? See how easy I can get rid of your damn flames. 
Fuck you. Hurry up. Well, I'm not gonna celebrate your ass, so you can burn in hell. See, I never break promises. Oh, what the fuck? Where's the fucking roof key? I mean, the roof door. This way. Yeah, it's probably this way. Alright, so we're gonna leave without her because she's a fucking bitch. <gasps> oh, shit, my god! Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I don't know how you got up here, you creepy fucker. But, um... I definitely made a wise decision to leave that stupid slut over there. And I'm off. Yay! I can get out of this fucking... Well, I finally left this fucking piece of shit hospital. Oh my god, wow. That's the end, guys. I finally got rid of that bitch. Well, guys, that's the end of Mental Memorial. Obviously, I had the option to save my, I guess, wife. But obviously, you know, she sent monsters to kill me. So obviously, I'm not going to live with a psychopath. So um, I let her basically burn in hell. So she, she's dancing with the devil somewhere in it right now. So... Um, and I'm very proud of my decision. And I can finally be a happy, free man. Right? So, um... Oh, apparently the creator of this has a girlfriend. I guess she's the one who voiced this lady. I don't know. But she's a fucking psychopath. Um... 1 out of 10, I would rate this a fucking 6. Just because it, it just, it wasn't, there weren't enough monsters. But um, anyways, um, thank you guys for joining me in this adventure, as always. Um, and watching, subscribing if you have. And I will see you guys in another video. Um, I won't be doing Amnesia for a while, because I've been doing that too much. But um, yeah. So Eileen Warno signing out, and I'll see you guys later.